Lamu, today is our last day here. We feel so sad because we've had one of our best times in, in, in this world, in this island, enjoying the pristine beaches of Mande, enjoying the sunrise and the sunset. They, call, they say Lamu has the best sunrise and sunset. We live the moment, we saw it all. Um, we sailed through some of the best, cleanest um, seas and beach uh, in this part of the world. We enjoyed the UNESCO World Heritage Site in Lamu. It's like going back time. This is how uh, the mixed feeling we had. At one place, you're going to have some of the best hotels in the world. Some place you're going to feel like you're going back time. Lamu will give you some of the best food. We enjoyed some of the best meal, some of the seafood at the most affordable price. Leaving this place, we were so sad because uh, we spent our time in one of the most secure places. Actually, Lamu is one of the most secure places I've ever been. Like you'd literally sleep outside, even leave all your gadget outside and no one will touch it. It's been that magical. So the, today is the last day of our time and uh, we're heading back to Malindi. And uh, so this road from Lamu to Malindi has been tarmac for the last, for the first time since independence. So, so much is, uh, you will see so much on the road, so much is ongoing. Uh, and this is part of the larger Lapset project. So guys, follow me and uh, let's see. Thank you. This is the Africa. Don't forget to check our previous upload on Lamu. So right now we are heading to Mokoi. Mokoi is uh, one of the main towns that links uh, Lamu Island to the mainland. So all the bulk goods coming with trucks, trucks, lorries, buses uh, are light at Mokoi and uh, are taken to Lamu by boats, doors and yeah, ships. The road from Lamu to Malindi is about 136 miles or 218 uh, kilometers so yeah
guys if you've ever had Hindi this is the town So if you ever thought fig tree was only in Karen, I can see fig tree house here. There's no life, kilometers and kilometers. There's no human life here. You don't see people at all. Like you move kilometers and kilometers. No people. I just see some, there's some, yeah, there's some activity going on here. And it's just associated with the construction of the road. I think this is KPLC, the KPLC team is here. See their car. So the first major town is in Piketoni. I'm 
really eager to see Piketoni. I don't know if I'm on the side. I'm not on the side. Oh, too bad. When you see the locals, once in one in a million. Okay. I believe there are more kettles here than the human. Some center here, some activity in this town. It's a small center. Koreni. 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 It's called Koreni. Or Koreni Primary School. Interesting. Guys, this place is called Majembeni and I'm told it's called Majembeni because guys here farm like just guys farm and the dominant community the, the, most of the people around these places are called the Kikuyu Ah, uh, Sineta! So this is just within Peketon, isn't it? So what do people farm mostly here? Wanali Manini? Mahindi Oh, so it's just maize, huh? Maize and maize The story of Peketoni is uh, very interesting because uh, uh, during the first government, so many of the Kikuyu people were brought here with the first president. Yeah. It's called Majembeni. So, guys, Majembe means. Wow. Majembe in English, <laughs> uh, Nene. Fog, let's see fog. Just look at the kettles. Probably called a hoe, you know, the hoe that you guys are thinking. <laughs> Mavuno, Mavuno, guys, Mavuno, Mavuno. It's called harvesting, it's all about farming. Mavuno 
is a Swahili word for um, is a Swahili word basically meaning harvesting. This is the center. Mavuno. Orma. Uh, guys, this is the Orma community. They are basically pastoralists. Eh? So um, they deal with a lot of milk, you can see. Oh, this is milk. Ah. Wow. So we have to pick maziwa. We have to pick up the Yijin. Sema, Wabi. Sema. Wabi. Mostly uh, to community, Muslim community. Guys, just look at the milk. Wow. The milk center. So they take the milk. Oh, I think Lamu, I think Oh, look at the number, the sheer number of cows they have. It's huge, eh? Wow. And most of the cows are white. Uh, like to make a say, yeah, it's usually brown, but. Literally see nothing. It's it's a dense forest in short. Super dense. I see you here. Many if 
juga entah aku pergi ya Ngam As you can see, we have some construction on going uh -huh. right now And they stretch into the bony forest Bongoni. From here all the way to Malindi is now Tama. To Mombasa. To Mombasa. Yeah. Uh. Oh, so. Uh. So guys, uh, we're being told Labania, Labania, Missy Dwin in it. So Labania tengo in an Oh it's milk and oh my milk and, milk and sugar. Ah <laughs> yes, milk and sugar. So guys, this is the chocolate of this place. Everybody's telling me Labania, Labania. Yeah, we're in a place called Witu. There's a roadblock. It's time for the police to leave now. Hmm. It's like an energy bar, you know. I can feel the taste of the milk and sugar. It's well balanced. Wow. The road is super smooth after we two. Yeah? You see that? Fully tarmacked, fully marked. 
ready for you to cruise. Gamba. Huh? Network Gamba. Gamba. Police station. Ya Hayaka. Ah, Network Gamba Sai.
ndi nipe mimi nenda nao ah ofisini hapo hii town gani hii kunaitwa Kisowe 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 So guys, on my right, that is the way to Garissa. So this is where the road to Lapu. Andu Vipi? Andu Vipi? Andu Lapu. Sawa. That road leads to Garissa. So most of it is most of it is constructed. Very few places to finish a big toll. And this leads to Mombasa. And you're telling me all these roads uh, was a uh, rough road for all those years. This is independence. Wow. Mchuma mrefu Oh, hiyo ni nias Oye, nataka mwa
sa dundana e sa dundana e chama de dona que laquito a hoja não pegue As you can imagine, three watermelons for a hundred shillings. Wow. So, tattoo me? Yeah, tattoo me. Wow. This is a big one. Yeah. This is a big one. 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 Be watermelon will be like 200 per piece, right. and here is three for 100. Wow, National Government Constituency Kauli This is where they make salt. Oh, it's on the horizon. Oh, wow, that is a salt factory. Guys, we're in Burawa, and this is where we pro 
this is where salt comes from. Most of the salt in Kenya. This is very interesting. See the factory guys? That is where your stable salt comes from. Heaps and heaps of salt. company That is how they are. That's how it's prepared. You know. Church Gongoni. This is the center. Look at the bird dove. Mix 
sasa wamekisia wengine Shengia na hiyo anje ya karibu ni Vilas Kuna Musema get ya ready Hapa karibu ni Vilas na pita So guys we are at Sapaki Sapaki Ni ndo nenda kuona na hile river na bahari wizi mishka Oh, the sabaki, oh The sabaki is the end of Ati River, right? Aha Wow This is the town, so many military guys Alil, this feels like a war zone, huh? You just look at this Mbuna 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 so this is the river Sabaki. The river Sabaki is here, Sasa. This is the river Sabaki. Mm -hmm. Needle. What? What? 